Yo, what up is Don? Family here. The Soul Brothers. <coughs> All up in your notification. <coughs> um, Hello. That's how we do. You know, what up, Blaze? Light up in with a new video. This is a. This is a shoe that I was not going to do because it's exactly the same basically as the regular version. I don't know why they're calling it an elite, but Donnie boy was like, I'm gonna cop them because we were at the, the Nike store and they were there. So we, uh, he went, shoe. he did uh, cop it. Yes. The KD9 Elite. And it is, uh, it's a, it's a, obviously it's a more premium version. And just right out the gate, it looks more premium. Yes. Which, at least there's that. It smells more premium. Uh, if you want to cop these, by the way, we're going to leave a link in the description. Um, now, the price is the same. That is crazy. That's another very interesting thing. Yeah, if uh, if they were like 160 or 170 I was going to be like, dude, that's stupid. Uh, it's the, the exact same shoe, but it's the same price point, which was I wish I was surprised. So, um... There's one uh, piece of, there's one aspect <coughs> of this shoe that I already think it's way better than the KD9. And that is... Should the, I talk about that now or, or in the review? Let's kind of, let's kind of go over let's, the tech. Yeah, let's go over everything. And then you can talk about it, you know? Okay, so if you've never uh, seen the KD9 or you've never seen a performance review, you have like a honeycomb pattern on the bottom. It, um, it's, it's decent, you know, but it's not the best traction. That's its biggest downfall of the entire shoe. What a dust. Uh, and dust gets caught on a little bit. Um, moving on from there, you have full length zoom, which is very, very nice. Okay, um, everything is exactly the same as the KD9 from the midsole down. Now we get into the upper where they did switch it up a little bit. The, the, the fly knit in the, from the uh, ankle to the toe is just nicer. Really? Well, it's just like more tightly woven. Think so? It feels more like a jacquard. Like it's a little smoother than than the other one. I feel like they're both nice though. Yeah, no, they're both nice. Uh -huh. I prefer this one a little bit. Yeah. I think it's because it's a cooler looking. Uh, I like well, this it, pattern it looks, better. Yeah, the pattern is better for yeah. sure. But I, I like how it's a little bit thinner. The the regular is a little bit really? the regular more is like knitted. Pretty, really? Yeah, it has like tumbles in it, you know? It feels like it's like like the same thickness, no? Yeah. No, just you feel how it's all tumbly and stuff. Uh -huh. This one's just flat, like smooth, like a jacquard more, which I kind of like, mm -hmm. you know. And yeah. then the back half is this nice kind of. What is this? Uh, it feels like a satin almost. Satin. You know what I mean? <laughs> Seriously, it's like silk. They're, they're so freaking silk in the shoe, man. <laughs> And, and they made the check mark a little smaller and it's a dope like little shine mm -hmm. Reminds me of the PG shinings a little yeah. bit um, And then you have this kind of little baby compression sleeve that comes up. It's just what about an that, inch What does that do? Nothing. It's just for looks and it just kind of wrap, hugs your ankle a little bit. It's I chill. Guess, yeah, you know um, But uh, another thing the main main difference obviously is, is this lacing system. Yes, so okay. uh, oh. No, go ahead. Okay, so um, I actually checked and I actually filmed it. Um, I was gonna say, you know, in previous models of shoes, like in the Jordan CP3, no, I don't remember what shoe it was, but uh, remember how they would um, make it look like it's fly wire and then you tighten it and then it's supposed to tighten like this with the laces? Yeah. But then they actually uh, stitch the laces down yeah. with, I'm just like, what the fuck yeah. is the point? So you're not really pulling from the bottom exactly. where the midsole is, you're pulling from the eyelet. Yes, but as you guys can see from this clip, um, the flywire actually is free flowing. Yeah. So um, once you tighten the laces, it actually tightens the flywire cable with it and it'll act as a cage, um, as in uh, Nike's description, um, and keep you locked down better. And does it feel a little bit more locked down? Like kind of like in the forefoot area more. Oh yeah, it, it feels it's pretty crazy. Really? I mean, yeah, it really hugs your foot, especially uh -huh. these laces go all the way up close to the toe. Uh -huh. I mean, they do they go pretty close to the toe in the um, in the normal one also. Yeah. But you can really crank it down, really? like really hug your foot. The the best part about the lacing system is there's this loop which wraps around to the back that's actually free running, and when you crank this top. Uh, these top wires down, it really squeezes on the back of your ankle, completely abolishing any sign or remnants of heel slippage at all. Nike, I love you. Adidas, you're, you're slipping. You guys, you have to fix that, you know what I'm saying? Like in the KD9, it, it's there's no heel slippage, but it's not like super locked down to me. This gets crazy locked down. Really? Yeah, like as much, you know, as much as you want. You can really, you can tone it back or you can get really tight just in the top uh, in the top lace 
and it just locks your it down right on your ankle. And already, I love this shoe so much more because of that. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just a nice thing to have. And if it's the same price, I mean, already before we do the, the full review, I, I would say it's a no brainer to get this over the regular. Yeah, K9. that's true. Um, I mean, like, if it and was, I think it looks a little bit doper. I mean, it looks like, so? yeah, it just looks like a little more premium. Oh, yeah. This this material in the back of this one is a little cheap looking to me. Oh, yeah. The foam back mesh. It's, yeah, I mean, it's cool, but I don't know. I'm not mad at these. Uh -huh. But I'm gonna get. I'm gonna. We're gonna get on the court with these and, and really put them to the test and see what else is different. What is this? Like kind of like a suede or something? Yeah, it, it, it feels like almost like a real suede. Yep. This you is know. Kevin Durant. Feels pretty premium, uh, all the way around. But like another thing is that they didn't fix the defect yeah. right here, um, connecting the toe uh, zoom bag and the uh, the full length zoom bag because uh, once you like kind of bend it, if you bend it a little too much, um, it'll rip and it'll pop your airbag, and that was was a defect, and they did not fix it in the elite, which I don't know why they didn't. Yeah, that's but, crazy. You know, uh, that was a problem and. But we'll see. Uh, the performance will, review will be coming soon. Mm -hmm. um, tell us what you guys think of the shoe and if we can find a link for uh, you guys to copy. If you guys want to copy, we'll leave it in the description box below. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Peace.